Abuja. Emeka explained that the conference was organized to create awareness and equip farmers with modern techniques on the various processing and packaging methods to meet up with international standards. He, however, enjoined the federal government to provide supporting policies that will encourage smallholder farmers to help increase the agricultural value chain and boost food production in the country. Well, the government are our partners. Uh, the FCT are hosting this event. And the Federal Minister of Agriculture also is a partner. Federal Minister of Trade and Investment is also a partner. But we need more. We need more partnership. We need more support. We need more encouragement because this is a private sector driven initiative and everybody here is putting in their best. So we need the government to respond more. This effort is a direct response to President Mohamed Buhari's call to return to agriculture. So we came together and we said we have to play our role in this. So we are all along the value chain, we are doing different things to improve agriculture in Nigeria. So we need the government to engage us more. Senator Bima Mohammed, the Senate Committee Chair on Agriculture, just spoke. He's a great man. He has ideas on how we can channel our efforts directly to impact the farmers. So we have a meeting with him at the National Assembly tomorrow. He wants to meet the team and talks about things, the Senate, other legislation that can be put in place to be able to help agriculture in Nigeria. The Permanent Secretary, Federal Minister of Agriculture and Rural Development, Ernest Umakihe, who was represented by the Director of Special Duties, Fausat Lawal, reiterated the commitment of the Ministry to enhance food security and economic development through agricultural activities. Through agricultural activities. The Federal Ministry of Agricultural and Rural Development is to coordinate the vast efforts at improving agricultural value chain development and provision of rural infrastructures by a large army of players. The policy has already laid a foundation for a very simple roadmap to modernize the agricultural sector in line with the changing global food systems and supply chains. It has also set an agenda to open doors to innovative entrepreneurs, local and international researchers and investors to team up with our small and large older farmers so as to boost quality outcomes from the sector. The chairman, Senate Committee on Agriculture, Senator Bima Enagi, also speaking at the conference, noted that successful mechanism is the key to tackling global food security challenges in agriculture, hence advocates for national extension system to transfer the use of mechanized farming to local users and also set up knowledge addition into agriculture supporting system. Mechanization is not only for TV land, it also includes planting, harvesting, processing, and storage facilities. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, with the fast growing population in the country, decreasing agricultural production and current security challenges, our sustainable food security is more threatened if we do not expose innovative farming techniques to farmers and facilitate the utilization of such techniques. Our collective commitment at this expo will further generate positive feeling towards achieving desired agricultural innovative ideas, thereby translating the resolutions and gains of this conference and expo into agricultural revolution. The theme is unveiling and entrenching sustainable food solutions through mechanization and innovation.